After the highly anticipated launch of the James Webb Space Telescope, hopes were high for its ability to unveil the mysteries surrounding the Big Bang and reveal previously unknown celestial bodies. However, the scientific community was stunned by its latest groundbreaking finding. Esteemed astrophysicist Michio Kaku even suggested that this discovery not only deserves a Nobel Prize, but also raises concerns about the potential threat to the universe's existence. The burning question remains, what is this startling revelation, and do we need new laws of physics to explain these perplexing phenomena? Join us as we delve into the James Webb Telescope's latest discovery, which has the potential to unravel the very fabric of the universe. The James Webb Telescope stands as humanity's most advanced tool for space exploration, representing one of NASA's most ambitious science projects to date. With over two decades of construction and a budget of $10 billion, this telescope commands both attention and admiration from the scientific community. Recently, it made a groundbreaking observation that shook the world the transmission of concrete evidence of a black hole. What's even more astonishing is that this colossal black hole is not solitary. It appears to be linked to something scientists liken to the universe's reset button. Before we explore the implications of this momentous revelation for our solar system, let's closely examine this extraordinary discovery. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, designed to surpass the capabilities of the Hubble Space Telescope, is primarily tasked with observing the universe in infrared light. This unique ability enables it to penetrate dust and observe objects too faint or distant for other telescopes to discern. The JWST boasts several scientific goals, encompassing the study of galaxy formation and evolution, observation of distant objects in the early universe, exploration of exoplanet atmospheres, and investigation into star and planetary system formation. One of its standout features is its expansive primary mirror, spanning 6.5 meters, 21 feet, in diameter, and comprising 18 hexagonal segments. This sizable mirror enables the telescope to gather more light and achieve superior resolution compared to its predecessors. Coated with a thin layer of gold, the mirror enhances its ability to reflect infrared light. Another pivotal instrument aboard the JWST is the Near Infrared Camera, NIR Cam designed for capturing images of celestial bodies within the infrared spectrum. NIR CAM excels at observing faint, distant objects, including the earliest galaxies formed in the universe. Additionally, the JWST is outfitted with various scientific instruments, such as the Near Infrared Spectrograph, NIR SPEC, for analyzing celestial object compositions, the Mid-Infrared Instrument, MIRI, for studying star and planetary system formation, and the Fine Guidance Sensor, FGS, and near-infrared imager and slitless spectrograph, NIRIS, for precise telescope pointing and alignment. Launching and deploying the JWST is a complex endeavor, representing a collaborative effort between NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA. Launched on December 25, 2021, via an Ariane 5 rocket from French Guiana, the JWST embarked on a journey involving several deployments and maneuvers to reach its designated orbit, situated approximately 1.5 million kilometers, 930,000 miles, from Earth. As the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, Webb has ignited considerable excitement within the scientific community. According to the Space Telescope Science Institute, individuals worldwide are eagerly sharing its images and utilizing raw data to uncover new insights. Since its deployment, the telescope has facilitated numerous significant discoveries, leading to over 750 scientific publications incorporating data from the James Webb Space Telescope. Let's delve into some of the captivating findings made thus far. In the 1990s, scientists initially detected exoplanets orbiting distant stars by observing the dimming of starlight as planets transited in front of them. However, the JWST has revolutionized exoplanet observation capabilities by directly capturing images, thanks to its advanced instruments. Within a year of launch, the Webb Telescope achieved a historic milestone by capturing its first direct image of exoplanet HIP-65-426b, a gas giant situated 100 times farther from its star than Earth from the Sun. Utilizing multiple filters and cameras, Webb generated composite images of this sizable planet. Beyond the visual spectacle, these discoveries underscore the telescope's prowess and significantly impact astronomy. 
EP65426b's remarkable size, approximately 12 times that of Jupiter, coupled with its distance from its star, facilitated image capture. However, the significance of direct exoplanet imaging transcends aesthetics, offering insights into the universe's origins and the potential for extraterrestrial life beyond our solar system. These images offer valuable insights into planetary formation and the atmospheres of exoplanets, potentially contributing to the discovery of habitable exoplanets, a long-standing goal for scientists. While habitable exoplanets are currently considered rare, the observation capabilities of the Webb telescope position it to make groundbreaking discoveries in this regard. The images transmitted by the James Webb Space Telescope have revolutionized our understanding of the universe. They reveal numerous stars and galaxies, with older galaxies appearing reddish and darker. Researchers from diverse teams swiftly commenced analyzing these images using advanced computer technologies. Leveraging state-of-the-art tools, scientists have extracted a wealth of information from each point of light, determining factors such as light age, reflective elements, galaxy movement speed, and estimated star count within them. However, the latest discovery made by the James Webb Telescope has sparked concern among experts, as it is believed to possess the potential to disrupt the universe. What exactly is this astounding revelation from the James Webb Telescope, and why is it causing such a stir? The James Webb Space Telescope stands as a remarkable achievement in modern technology. Through its observations, researchers have made significant discoveries, including ancient galaxies and a massive black hole with a mass 10 million times greater than our Sun. According to the Big Bang Theory, during that time, there should have only been star prototypes and collections of stars. However, the James Webb Space Telescope transmitted images revealing six galaxies that appeared massive, bright, and teeming with stars. What's particularly intriguing is scientists' speculation that these galaxies may harbor supermassive black holes, which have been identified through gravitational lensing. Black holes are immensely captivating and enigmatic phenomena in space. They represent regions where gravity is exceptionally intense, exerting a force that draws objects towards each other. When a star is exceptionally massive, it can undergo a remarkable process known as a supernova as it reaches the end of its lifespan. During a supernova event, the star undergoes a cataclysmic explosion, shedding its outer layers into space. What remains is a dense core that can collapse under its own gravitational force, giving rise to a black hole. A black hole essentially forms as a result of this collapsed core becoming extraordinarily dense and compact. Its density is so immense that the gravitational pull it exerts is incredibly powerful. In fact, the gravitational force is so intense that nothing, not even light, can escape its grasp if it ventures too close to the black hole. This absence of emitted or reflected light is what earns it the name black hole. Supermassive black holes, as their name implies, are extraordinarily large and can possess millions or even billions of times the mass of our sun. They are believed to exist at the centers of most galaxies, including our own Milky Way galaxy. The region surrounding a black hole is referred to as the event horizon. Once an object crosses the event horizon, it becomes ensnared within the black hole's grasp and is unable to escape. This is why direct observation or detection of black holes is challenging, as they emit no light of their own. However, we can discern their presence through their influence on nearby matter. Yet, the observation of black holes and distant objects poses difficulties, potentially causing us to overlook many of the universe's oldest galaxies and black holes because they remain invisible to us. Nonetheless, advancements in technology, such as those offered by the James Webb Space Telescope, offer hope through gravitational lensing. Gravitational lensing, an effect that can render even ancient and massive black holes visible, holds promise in enriching our comprehension of the early universe. The recent discovery sent shockwaves through the astronomical and cosmological communities, as James Webb captured images of ancient galaxies that defy conventional understanding. These distant celestial wonders have sparked urgent inquiries that beg for swift resolution. Yet, the telescope's lens has penetrated the cores of galaxies, exposing ultramassive black holes with incomprehensible gravitational influence dominating their centers. Such revelations have the potential to reshape our fundamental understanding of the cosmos, 
leading some scientists to dub it the Universe Breaker. Through NASA's telescopic endeavors, astronomers have unveiled the most remote X-ray detected black hole ever recorded. Remarkably, this black hole is in an early phase of development and possesses a mass comparable to its host galaxy, an occurrence previously unseen in astronomical observation. This discovery holds the potential to illuminate the origins of some of the earliest supermassive black holes in the cosmos. Through the combined data from NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory and the James Webb Space Telescope, a team of researchers discerned a distinctive signature indicating the growth of a black hole just 470 million years following the Big Bang. Leveraging the gravitational lensing effect facilitated by the James Webb Telescope, which acts akin to a magnifying glass, the researchers intensified the light and X-rays emitted by both the galaxy and its supermassive black hole. This black hole was situated within a galaxy known as US-1, nestled within the Abel 2744 galaxy cluster, residing some 3.5 billion light-years away from Earth. Remarkably, analysis of the web data unveiled that the galaxy itself lies at a much greater distance, approximately 13.2 billion light-years away, depicting a snapshot of the universe when it was merely 3% of its present age. Webb's capabilities enabled the capture of imagery depicting these ancient galaxies as they appeared over 13 billion years ago. Concurrently, observations conducted with the Chandra telescope over a two-week period corroborated the existence of intensely hot, X-ray-emitting gas within the galaxy, a telltale sign of a burgeoning supermassive black hole. The light and X-rays emanating from both the galaxy and its black hole were amplified by external matter within the Abel 2744 cluster, facilitating their detection by the Webb telescope. This discovery holds significant implications for understanding how supermassive black holes rapidly accumulate vast masses shortly after the Big Bang. The researchers are actively exploring whether these black holes originate directly from the collapse of massive gas clouds, resulting in black holes boasting masses ranging between 10,000 and 100,000 times that of the Sun. Led by Akos Bogdan of the Center for Astrophysics at Harvard, the team uncovered compelling evidence indicating that the newly identified black hole was born with considerable mass, estimated to range between 10 and 100 million times that of the Sun. This mass spectrum corresponds closely to the collective mass of the stars within the galaxy, which stands in stark contrast to black holes observed in neighboring galaxies, typically containing only around a tenth of a percent of their host galaxy's stellar mass. The substantial mass of this nascent black hole, coupled with its X-ray emissions and the luminosity of the galaxy detected by the Webb Telescope, lends support to theoretical predictions posited in 2017 by co-author Priyangvada Nutrajan of Yale University. These predictions suggested the existence of an unusually large black hole formed directly from the collapse of a massive gas cloud. While intriguing, this revelation may not bode entirely well for our universe. Recent reports have surfaced suggesting that the James Webb Telescope has unveiled two groundbreaking revelations this year regarding black holes. The initial discovery disclosed the presence of an immense, unidentified entity being drawn into the black hole at the heart of our galaxy. The subsequent finding is even more astounding. Advanced extraterrestrial civilizations purportedly harnessing black holes as quantum computers. These dual discoveries, unveiled concurrently, have prompted speculation among researchers regarding potential connections between them. Scientists observed a colossal object hurtling towards the core of our galaxy's black hole. Initially conjectured to be an alien spacecraft engaged in quantum computing, this object has sparked considerable intrigue and debate within the scientific community. However, subsequent investigations determined it to be a substantial cloud of dust and gas named X-7. X-7, approximately 50 times larger than Earth, has been elongated by the gravitational pull of the black hole. It follows a trajectory leading towards the black hole and is projected to eventually collide with it. While the link between the sizable entity X, 7 and the potential utilization of black holes as quantum computers remains unexplicit, there is an implicit suggestion that the discovery of X, 7 prompted conjecture about extraterrestrial involvement in quantum computing. It's crucial to clarify that discussions concerning aliens and quantum computers do not conjure images of whimsical extraterrestrials surfing the internet in front of a black hole. 
Quantum computing represents a sophisticated scientific concept involving the utilization of quantum mechanics properties for advanced computational tasks. Black holes have captivated scientists ever since Albert Einstein postulated their existence in his theory of general relativity. These astronomical behemoths, characterized by their intense gravitational pull, have seized our fascination, defying the laws of physics in ways that remain incompletely comprehended. In contrast to prior assumptions, recent telescope observations have unveiled that black holes were more prevalent and massive in the early universe than previously surmised. Until now, researchers theorize that black holes materialize from the collapse of massive stars at the conclusion of their life cycle, culminating in a spatial singularity where gravitational forces become infinite. However, the revelations brought forth by the James Webb Telescope challenge this comprehension, hinting at the existence of galaxies harboring black holes prior to the Big Bang, thereby raising profound inquiries regarding the universe's age and the genesis of black holes. Furthermore, the James Webb Space Telescope has unveiled six galaxies, each serving as a testament to the cosmos' diversity and intricacy. These galactic entities engage in a vibrant cosmic ballet, showcasing the splendor of the universe. Yet, amidst this celestial spectacle, black holes emerge as insatiable behemoths, engulfing everything in their vicinity with their unfathomable gravitational pull. If these black holes were once dormant stars that expanded through matter consumption or mergers with other black holes, their current colossal size would have necessitated millions or even billions of years to attain. Notably, the identified galaxies existed approximately 13.6 billion years ago indicating that the Big Bang transpired 200 million years prior to their existence. This incongruity challenges our comprehension of black holes, star formation, and galaxy evolution, casting doubt on the established Big Bang theory and instilling apprehension in scientists regarding the universe's fate. The existence of black holes carries profound implications for our universe's trajectory. Scientists harbor concerns that it could signify the commencement of its demise. The presence of supermassive black holes at galaxies' cores presents a captivating phenomenon with extensive ramifications for galactic development and evolution. These colossal entities, boasting masses millions or even billions of times that of our Sun, exert gravitational influences that impact surrounding stars, gases, and celestial bodies. Supermassive black holes play a pivotal role in shaping the dynamics of star formation and galaxy expansion. When matter, such as stars and gases, falls within the gravitational grasp of a supermassive black hole, it undergoes a process known as accretion, wherein gravitational forces draw matter into the black hole's vicinity. As matter descends towards the black hole, it coalesces into a swirling disk comprised of hot gas and dust enveloping the black hole. Subjected to intense gravitational forces and friction, this disk undergoes extreme heating, leading to the emission of robust jets and energetic particle winds from the accretion disk. These emissions can significantly impact the surrounding environment, particularly by heating the gas within the galaxy. By raising the temperature of the gas, the jets and winds prevent its cooling and subsequent collapse, hindering the formation of new stars. This inhibition of star formation carries substantial implications for the galaxy's overall structure and evolutionary trajectory. The regulation of star formation by supermassive black holes entails a delicate balance. While the accretion process furnishes energy that can impede gas cloud collapse and star formation, the emitted jets and winds can also stimulate star formation in other galactic regions. The interplay between these mechanisms dictates the pace of new star formation and influences both the central black hole's growth and the galaxy's evolution. Additionally, the activity of supermassive black holes is believed to exert a feedback effect on the galaxy. The energy discharged during the accretion process can propel potent outflows that expel gas from the galaxy, potentially depleting the gas reservoir available for future star formation. Moreover, these outflows can transport heavy elements and other materials generated by the black hole back into the galaxy, enriching the interstellar medium and shaping the composition of subsequent celestial formations. Scientists have put forth several theories to elucidate the formation and expansion of supermassive black holes. One prevailing hypothesis proposes that colossal gas clouds in the nascent universe directly underwent gravitational collapse, culminating in the birth of supermassive black holes. 
These clouds, rich in hydrogen and helium, sidestepped star formation and instead collapsed under their own gravity, yielding supermassive black holes. Another conjecture suggests that supermassive black holes accrue mass by assimilating smaller black holes or stellar mass black holes. As black holes ingest surrounding matter, their mass amplifies through mergers and ongoing accretion, eventually reaching supermassive proportions. The amalgamation of galaxies is also deemed instrumental in supermassive black hole formation. During galactic collisions, the central black holes can gravitate towards each other, ultimately merging to form a larger black hole. In densely populated galactic locales, runaway stellar collisions may generate massive stellar entities or stellar clusters. These entities or clusters can eventually collapse under their own gravitational pull, giving rise to supermassive black holes. Additionally, certain theories posit that supermassive black holes originated shortly after the Big Bang in the primordial universe. These hypothetical black holes, dubbed primordial black holes, could have emerged due to intense density fluctuations in the early universe. Subsequent mass accretion would have facilitated the growth of these primordial black holes into supermassive ones. These conjectures imply that the extreme conditions prevalent during the early universe might have expedited black hole formation, circumventing the protracted stellar evolutionary process. Nonetheless, it's crucial to underscore that scientific inquiry and observations persist, continually refining our comprehension of the cosmos. Researchers are diligently investigating the actions of supermassive black holes, galactic mergers, and the overarching configuration of the universe to unravel the enigmas concerning the destiny of our cosmos. Thank you for embarking on this journey with us. Don't forget to subscribe and become a part of our community for additional content.